All right, this is Christopher Fox once again, and hold on for a minute. <laughs> Sorry to sum up the door, but this is a request this time from Annabelle. And the name of this video is Halloween Ends is Ridiculous. Yeah, Ridiculous is being too kind, but it's one minute long, so I'm going to get my commentary as the video goes on. It was uploaded by Impression Blend, so... Um, this is her video talking about the movie right after she sh right after she saw, I guess. But I uh, must get into it. Yay! Cars air freshener didn't. Right. Just watched Halloween ends, and my question is, how do these movies keep getting worse? I wasn't the biggest fan of the 2018 Halloween, but uh, the Halloween 2018 is my favorite out of the three, actually. <clears throat> I actually thought it had some cool ideas. I like how they brought Jim Lee Curtis and back and Jim, James Jude Courtney, I think is his name, played a good Michael Myers. I like the score. Yeah, the kills weren't that brutal, but they were still pretty cool as, as is. But it was still decent. Halloween Kills was worse and evil certainly did not die that night. I actually liked Halloween Kills. I thought it was a stupid, dumb... I have a prime drink today. It's good shit, but I thought Halloween Kills was a decent, weird, cheesy slasher, kind of like Friday the 13th throwback. Definitely one of the more weaker ones, but I, I enjoyed it. And now Halloween ends is unfortunately even more ridiculous over the top. It's the worst one, one out of the three for one. sure. I could tell you about the terrible dialogue, the bizarre plot choices, the questionable acting, the weird tone, the clumsy themes, the overall chaos and lack of logic, or the fact that it's really hard to care for any of these characters. So they all kind suck. Of sitting there hoping their Even Allison. Be creative. But here's the movie's biggest misstep. Michael Myers is barely in it. Yeah. yeah like that that's the biggest problem with fans. the fucking movie. If you're wrapping up a franchise about one of the most iconic That's why it sucks. Villains. Wouldn't it make sense for him and the legendary final girl to be front and center of the movie? I guess not. Halloween Ends is ridiculous on many levels, and at this point, ending is the best thing this franchise can do. Because this movie just... What was that? The movie sucked. It was a terrible movie. I thought... It's definitely the worst out of the three... I rank them Halloween Ends, Halloween Kills, and Halloween 2018. So backwards, basically. I, th I mean, it's not as bad as, say, the Rob Zombie ones, <coughs> Resurrection, or even Halloween 5, even though I don't hate Halloween 5. It's definitely the worst out of the three in the trilogy, but like I said, it's definitely not... It's definitely not... Like, the worst horror film ever. And speaking of which, I'm going to rank my top five horror movies that's coming into 2023 after this video. So, stay tuned, stay tuned, stay tuned for that. And no, Megan isn't my top, my number one. You won't find that out soon enough. But, excuse me. Um, yeah. Um, I'll probably do a spoiler review of Halloween Ends. Probably, maybe not. I don't know. Um, shout out to Impression Blend for letting me use her video. Um, thanks for watching. Take care. I'm getting the fuck out of here, Sam and Mr. Fawcett, and fuck Halloween ends.